Well, it's not Skinny Minnie Miller, but it is Creme Melee, and it is Mike Titan and... Cemetery Jane. Cemetery Jane. We're here at the Metro Glacier, and to tell you all about the 709 Derby Girls, are you cruising for a bruising? Oh, I can just feel that, sir. So let's talk about the event that's coming up at the Ed Byrne Arena. I'm sorry, pardon me, Jack Byrne Arena this Saturday. That's right, June 18th. Right. So let's talk more. Uh, tell me about the times. Uh, the doors open at 6.30, and we're going to start with the pre-show at 7, with the bout starting at 7.30. Mm -hmm. And we have uh, tickets are $12 in advance, and they are 15 at the door, with uh, admission for 12 and under is free. You know, and this is really growing in uh, popularity, is it not? Oh, it definitely is. Um, it started in 2005 in Texas with one league. Since then, there are over 300 in the States. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> There's over 90 in Canada. It's, it's worldwide, really. It's the fastest growing sport out there right now. So it's really obvious, as we can see, it's not for the faint of heart, and people from all walks of life are doing it. They definitely are. I mean, we've got girls ranging from 18 to 50-plus uh, um, they, uh, they work as doctors, teachers, retail representatives, everything, yeah. Now, and not only is there about this weekend, and you call it about, about, but there's another bout coming up here at the Mac Pro Glacier in August as well. August 27th, we're going to have our second bout this season, yes. And tell me about the team going to Moncton. Yes, 709 Derby Girls, we are going to be traveling to Moncton this July. The Jam Jams will be representing the island, bringing all kinds of heavy hits and some friendly smiles to you. And you know, th there's a lot of leagues. Yes, yeah, I, I believe there are 12 leagues registered for the... <laughs> sorry. I have to cringe, I'm sorry. <laughs> How many leagues? There will be eight leagues uh, joining us in Moncton. Wonderful. Well, you know, it, it looks like a lot of fun, I'm sure, and I would certainly not be able to do it. So hats off to you. Thank you very much. Now, before we go to entertainment, there's something you've always wanted to do, so we may as well take this opportunity and do it now. Back to you, Fred. <laughs> All right, Fred.